Latest update from Ukraine frontlines today, October 14, 2023, Ukraine's counteroffensive continues in the south and east. Ukrainian forces have made gains in the Kherson region, liberating several villages and pushing Russian troops back towards the Dnipro River. In the east, Ukrainian forces are continuing to battle Russian forces for control of the Donbas region. Russia continues to bombard Ukrainian cities. Russian forces have launched artillery and missile attacks on several Ukrainian cities, including Kyiv, Kharkiv, and Mykolaiv. The attacks have caused widespread damage and civilian casualties. The United States announces a new military aid package for Ukraine. The United States has announced a new military aid package for Ukraine worth $625 million. The package includes HIMARS rocket systems, artillery ammunition, and other weapons and equipment. Interactive map of the Ukraine war. The map shows the current situation on the ground in Ukraine, with Russian-controlled territory marked in red and Ukrainian-controlled territory marked in green. The map also shows the location of ongoing battles and Russian artillery strikes. Overall, the situation on the ground in Ukraine remains fluid. Ukrainian forces have made gains in recent weeks, but Russia is still in control of a significant amount of territory. The war is likely to continue for some time, and it is difficult to predict who will ultimately emerge victorious.